This week, high school seniors everywhere are graduating and they're moving on to the next chapter in their lives. But tonight at Fenville's High School's graduation, one student in particular is sorely missed. Wes Leonard. He was a junior when he collapsed and died from an enlarged heart right after making a game-winning shot last year. Wes would have graduated tonight. 24 Hour News 8's Crystal Hilliard was at Fenville's commencement ceremony this evening, and she joins us live with more. Crystal? Brian, if Wes Leonard would have walked across the stage tonight, he would have rounded out the graduating class at a perfect 100. But tonight, for those who knew and loved Wes, it was not about mourning the loss of his death or mourning his loss. It was more about taking the memory of his life with them. As the giant Blackhawks seemingly watched from above, these high school seniors said goodbye to Fenville. Ninety-nine students crossed the stage into adulthood with diplomas in hand, smiles on faces, but secretly, some still carried heavy hearts. When I grabbed my diploma, I just went to um, Jocelyn and gave her my extra cap. Selena Beltran Pena lost her high school sweetheart Wes Leonard last year. He died of a heart attack just moments after sinking the game-winning shot. No one in Fenville has forgotten that day. Even today, his classmates embraced his mother, their choir teacher, as one of their own. He was supposed to be my walking partner. We planned it since freshman year. But his little brother Mitchell walked her in instead. I knew that we all had a breakdown moment um, last week, and Jocelyn, they just, they're my second family. It makes me really sad because uh, I think he, uh, he went too soon, but we're going to die young. And usually I'm not really the one to dress up, and I remember I had this from a basketball game, and I was like, well, this will be pretty good since everyone, it'll be a good way to remember him. Both of Leonard's jerseys have been retired and now hang in the gym where he took his last shot, not too far from that Blackhawk. West Leonard's death certainly not going in vain tonight. Since he died, many West Michigan schools have placed AEDs inside their gyms. We're live in Fenville tonight, Crystal Hilliard, 24-Hour News 8.